guys, it's Maka. You're watching a Nintendo Box video, and today I'm going to be talking about Fatal Frame or Project Zero and the live stream that they had today. It was Japan only, but it's been very interesting, and even people from the West have taken notice because hopefully this game is going to get released in the West. Now, we haven't yet got any announcement on it, but I'm really hoping for it because. Although personally I'm a massive wimp when it comes to horror games and anything horror. I'm so bad with it. I'm so gonna get this game if it comes out in the West. Because it looks absolutely fantastic. It looks like such a good game. And it's not being called open world but it's being called a game world within an open area. Which actually is somewhat close to open world I would imagine. Which would be pretty damn cool because if you've got something similar to an open world in a horror game in which you can actually get attacked by monsters anyway because that's also a feature in this monsters won't only come up in set places they'll actually be able to attack you and find you in any place during the game at any time in the japanese houses within the watery sections because this is a game that concentrates very much so on water and the border between life and death and the water is kind of like a metaphor for this and it's used to evoke thoughts of love warmth and it's all very picturesque and at the same time totally terrifying i was watching the trailer and i was shit scared out of my mind but at the same time i was looking forward to this i really again hope that this gets a western release because it's going to be amazing it uses the Wii U gamepad in a really interesting way which people have actually been calling for for absolutely ages which is that it uses the Wii U gamepad as a camera which some people may say is gimmicky but to be honest I think it's actually just an amazing use of the gamepad I think it's very clever and people have been asking for it with Pokemon Snap U if that was what it was going to be called a Pokemon Snap sequel for the Wii U for ages now so if you were hoping for a Pokemon Snap sequel then you know that this is going to at least appease you on that part of the idea but hopefully let's hope there's still going to be a Pokemon Snap because that would be amazing on the Wii U as well in the stream Shigeru Miyamoto from Nintendo the creator of Mario and other classic games came on and told people that he isn't big on scary games but this game will actually be great for bringing more diversity to the Wii U and I could not agree more because this is a game that shows such contrast to so many Nintendo franchises. And for people saying that the Wii U is only for kids, this shows the exact opposite. And it's going to bring some great adult-centered gaming to the Wii U. And personally, I will definitely buy this, although it's not my kind of game usually. Just because I want to test myself to see if I can cope with it. And also, it just looks brilliant. You can tell by the trailer, you can tell by the screenshots. I also have some faith in Tecmo Koei, or slash Koei Tecmo, that they'll make good games now as well because Hyrule Warriors looks absolutely brilliant and that's the first on my list. So anyway guys, that's been all from me, Maka. Thank you for watching this Nintendo Box video. I hope you've really enjoyed it. I've scared myself even making this video and watching the trailer. So I hope you really like it. Could you please leave a like? Also comment down below and subscribe to the channel. It's always a massive help and I just really appreciate it guys. So thank you very much. I hope you're looking forward to this game. Bye, guys.